Hi guys, my name is Coach Shadogs the Bomb, but built for theme park news. It is the day after that massive video upload session that we had yesterday with three theme park news updates and a predictions video. So today we're going to be focusing on our final predictions for Millen Entertainment's theme parks. The final last predictions video, the last final predictions video uh, of this year. And then these prediction videos, these prediction videos, will start again with our early 2022 predictions. For all three and by popular demand we're also going to be including da 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 sea world and bush gardens parks next year as well so next year we're going to be doing early mid-season and final 2022 predictions for six flags cedar fair Milton entertainment and sea world and bush gardens theme parks the sea world and bush gardens parks will be in the same video now that is due to popular demand, so the Prime Park Prediction series will get bigger and better than ever next year, so it's more of a reason to subscribe. Speaking of subscribing, here is how you can interact with the channel before we get on with this predictions video. If you've loved this video, make sure you hit the like button below. Make sure you also comment down below your thoughts and opinions on the video topic. And also make sure you subscribe to Coast Channel YouTube channel for more. And click the notification bell so you never miss a YouTube video. Please share the channel with your friends, your family and our social media. And make sure you also comment down below your video suggestions which will be saved. Your shout outs which will be saved for the next day's videos. And also make sure you send in your merchandise continuously on Instagram and Snapchat. The links for both are in the description down below and I'll save your merchandise pictures with your name and location for the next merchandise showcase video. Also make sure you get your questions in the comments down below. Use the hashtag question before or after your question and they will be saved for our 2000 subscriber Q&A. Also guys make sure you reach that subscriber goal of 10,000 subs in the next 365 days and counting. If we do that, I will release Coaster Channel merchandise on a new website as well as other projects I've got planned for the long term future. Let's get into another thrilling video. So let's begin off last predictions video of 2021 prediction season and it's Merlin Entertainment's Parks. And this is going to be, again, probably, probably the easiest one because we know what's pretty much happening. Um... So, starting off with Alton Towers Resort, and they're going to be adding the World of David Williams area, and also the World of David uh, and the Gangster Granny the Ride, especially within the area. Uh, so, basically, for those of you who don't know, Cloud Cuckoo Land is a wacky kids-themed area that opened at the park in 2009. Over the last few years, it's gone through a bit of ruin, uh, with attractions coming and going over the period of a few years. Obviously the final nail in the coffin came when Charlie was replaced by the Alton Towers Dungeon in its own Fountain Square kind of courtyard area with Hex uh, and the rest of Fountain Square. Um, but Cloud Cuckoo Land is finally getting the refurbishment it deserves and after a couple of years of rumoured negotiation breakdowns and renegotiation talks for the license ship, the world of David Williams will finally come alive at Alton Towers Resort in 2021. So. We do have the Cuckoo Cars Driving School. The Cuckoo Cars Driving School will be in its own area, its own sort of separate area, uh, away from the area. But I, I can definitely assure you guys that will be a phase two uh, in the near future, along with the theatre space. But in terms of attractions, we do know are going to be uh, in this area. Uh, we do have the Royal Carousel, which is a refurbishment of the Gallopers Carousel. We also do have um, the... Roger's Bouncy Bottom Burp, which is the re-theme of the Frog Hopper attraction. And also, we have the main attraction known as Gangster Granny the Ride. Now, Gangster Granny the Ride is a dart ride manufactured by Derby-based manufacturing company Garmondale and features many, many different scenes that take you on the journey to steal the crown jewels. This is a great themed area with a fabulous new dart ride and this will definitely be worth the wait. Moving into Chessington World of Adventures and again we know what's happening for next year. We've got the rainforest area that's open now in 2020 so that doesn't need to be delayed till 2021 which means we get a new attraction. Now recent teasing which I showed you in the update yesterday uh, clearly showed what many of us knew already. We're going to get a brand new drop tower coming to the old Ramesses Revenge site at Chessington World of Adventures in the Forbidden Kingdom section of the park. Now the flying jumbos were re-themed and relocated with an Elmer IP for 2020 
in the old blue and white carousel site uh, to allow for easy access into the construction site and of course to replace the site in general. Now the Ramesses Revenge Hus top spin was removed and construction on the site is well underway as we speak. Now the theme will be the Sobek which is an Egyptian crocodile myth. And the rumoured name, as trademarked by Millen Entertainment, will be Croc Drop. Now, the rumoured manufacturer is SBF Visa, who manufactured the world-class successful family drop tower at Poulton's Park Magma, which opened in 2012. This is another world-class family attraction, and we can't wait to experience it in the near future. Maybe even in 2021 when it opens. Moving into Gardaland Resort, and with this and the other European park in the Merlin chain, this is definitely, uh, once again, the easiest to predict, because I think we're just going to see general park improvements and no new attractions. With the Legoland Water Park still yet to open, which is their big development for 2020, it's fair to say it could be delayed till 2021, but we don't have official confirmation on that yet. But, from the sounds of it, Legoland Water Park could still open in late 2020. But I, didn't, I don't think that will, um, you know, prevent anything from happening in the park. I think the park will just have general improvements over uh, the next, uh, over this 2021 period. Moving into Heidi Park Resort, and again, same story. I think that their brand new family ride, Pepper's Balloon Ride, is... Um, I believe is already open. I'm not too sure, but I believe it's already open or is on the verge of opening itself. But I definitely believe that we could see some park improvements just like Gardaland. So a nice way to spruce up the park ready for the future and adding in any new rides and attractions in the next few years. So I think for both Hardy Park and Gardaland, it will be spruce up years around the theme park. Finally, Thorpe Park Resort. We have the brand new maze experience, the walkthrough visual experience, Black Mirror Labyrinth based on the famous show. It will be replacing the Walking Dead Living Nightmare, uh, which is the former maze at Fright Nights. Um, it uses the, sla the old Slammer Q uh, at Fright Nights, and of course that will be now used that area for Black Mirror Labyrinth. Now this high definition attraction will be a hypnotic uh, virtual maze where you get to walk through scenes from the Black Mirror and also we don't know much about it in terms of story however once again I can't wait to experience this attraction for the 2021 season so there we go that my friends is my final Merlin Entertainment predictions for 2021 very easy Garland and Heidi Park improvements and of course we know about the delayed attractions here in the UK Black Mirror Labyrinth at Thought Park Resort Croc Drop at Chessington World of Adventures Resort and World of David Williams with Gangster Granny the Ride at the Alton Towers Resort. So all three brilliant attractions. My, my personal aim is to experience all three attractions in the UK the, uh, next year in 2021. That's the dream, to go to Thorpe Park and do Black Mirror Labyrinth, to go to Chessington for my first ever visit in my lifetime and do uh, Croc Drop. And Alton Towers, as usual, like I do every year with Alton Towers, and travel there every year, uh, and do the World of David Williams uh, area with Gangster Grand of the Ride. Uh, so, very, very interesting. So, it's going to be an interesting watch uh, to see these being constructed even more uh, over the next few months. It's going to be great watching the construction period continue on all these attractions. And I cannot wait to see more from them. So that is it for the prediction videos for this year. Now you can go and check out the theme park predictions playlist. We can check out all our predictions videos from 2020 and 2021 in full on the playlist right now. Any other prediction videos that I've uploaded amongst them, uh, like the next roller coaster for Six Flags Great America and where and things like that, and the, I think there was a jungle area for Thought Part One and, and, the, and the, the next coaster at Lightwater Valley. Those three videos have all been moved to the Theme Park Newsroom playlist in the right places when they were uploaded. So they are now Theme Park Newsroom videos. So the Theme Park Predictions playlist is just Park Predictions. So, very good there. So you can check out all the 2020 and 2021 predictions across those two years on that playlist, which I'll link at the end of this video uh, for you to check out. But thank you very much, guys, for watching this video. Please like, comment, subscribe. My name is Coast Chow, Coot in the Coast Life, and I'll see you guys for another video upload very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have an awesome day.